Hello everyone, Dana here from Dana's Electrical Services and as you can see here in my hand I have a P-chop right, this is it right here P-chop because it shapes like a P right and right here I have a S-chop and also because it shapes like a S right and in today's video, I have a very simple video today. And that video is when do you use a S chop versus a P chop, right? So on this, well, this demonstration, I'm doing it. Well, this is a urinal, right? And um, the principle still remains the same. If it is a bathroom sink, a kitchen sink, the principle still remains the same so as you can see this is the drain right this is the drain and this is our system right here but because our drain goes down into the ground right we use a s chop we use a s chop but some drain it goes into the wall Right, so what if we didn't have our drain going down, but instead we have our drain going into the wall? Then we would need to use a P chop, right? So this would what this is what we would have used if this drain had gone into the wall versus it going down. So that is the main difference, guys. Um, as it relates to when do you use a S chop versus using a P chop. So there you have it. This was another video brought to you by Dana's Electrical Services. For more videos like these, please feel free to subscribe to my channel at Dana's Electrical Services. Thank you.